Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. My name is Tam and in today's video I'm going to be showing my uni apartment tour kind of thing. So I'm a student in Stellenbosch and I study at Stellenbosch Academy of Design and Photography and I am currently living in Ink Studios. So I'm just going to be showing you what the rooms look like. Well, one of the setups of what it looks like. And yeah, so I'm gonna take you around my little apartment, studio apartment <laughs> thing. So yeah, let's just get started. So I'm literally at like the, the door. So this is the door and yeah. So when you walk in, this is the like overview of what you would see when you walk in. Sorry about all my crap over there, but yeah. Okay, so I have two of these like hook things and I just literally have some like from, this bag is for groceries that's usually in my car. My raincoat's also usually in my car. Um, otherwise, I just keep my handbag here, then my apron. I have like my Polaroid carry case and this. So this is just my going out bag, but we don't go out anymore. So yeah, but it's still there. <laughs> Then, yeah, we have the light switch for the bathroom, which I'll get to now. Um, comes with like an alarm system, not gonna lie, I don't know how to use it, so I don't touch it. And then we have the like power switches over here. Oh, and down here I just have my little bin. It's like really tiny, like, like really tiny. Over here we have a fan for the bathroom. And then we have my light. I just switched off the fan. So yeah, it does work, but I, it's just gonna make too much noise. So this is the, the overview of my bathroom. Yes, I just showered, so everything is gonna be a little bit wet. <laughs> When you walk in, I have this mat from Mr. Price home. A lot of my stuff's from Mr. Price, by the way. My towel, Mr. Price. The little hand towel, Mr. Price. These hooks from Mr. Price as well. My laundry bag, which is full because I am going home to do my laundry. <laughs> so just excuse my like bedding. But yeah, that's my laundry bag. It's like a bag and then you can carry it. Um, yeah, so we then have the mirror. So that's the mirror. And as you can see, I'm like very short. <laughs> and then we have um, think the thing's kind of small not gonna lie like my hands pretty small so I don't know if that that gives you like a an idea we have my toothbrush hand soap little hand cream and yeah I have like all my toiletries and stuff um, have a little bin also from a surprise the toilet <laughs> and then like I have my little toilet brush there some duck I have this little like um, what is it? Like an air freshener thing, but it automatically does it. So you can set the time, so it'll spray like every 18 minutes or every hour or whatever you want. I have a candle, some crystals. Then this is also a cupboard where I store other stuff. So I have some of my hair stuff, nail stuff, and like extra stuff at the top. Then the shower is really nice because it's really spacious. So I have like a little bucket thing there. And then I have my loofah on the like handle. Uh, yeah, my soaps there, and then they come with like this little shelf, and I just have like my hair stuff at the top. So that is my bathroom, and you can close the door, but the door doesn't close properly because I decided to hang my full length mirror here because I had nowhere else to put it. So this is where I've put it. So I attach this. It comes so the bathroom does have hooks at the back here, but obviously I don't hang anything there because. Yeah, and that's why I have these ratchet ass hooks on the side of that. But anyways, so yeah, that was the bathroom. I'm now gonna go into like the kitchen. Over here we have this up cupboard and up there I have like toilet rolls, uh, washing stuff my towels which look really bad. I'm not messy, I promise. I'm not. But 
it's embarrassing but anyways and this is the microwave and then over here i just have some bin liners some kitchen cleaning stuff and then there's like okay a little bag here and then over here is my fridge it's pretty small um yeah i then have my my monthly planner which i'll put like important dates important deadlines and birthdays and stuff then yeah so we have a freezer on the top I have these little things from Yuppie Chef. These little magnet things that I never use. Oh, this is from Typo. I don't know if I mentioned that. And then this is, and this is the fridge. Then on the side here, I have, so I have this thing. I'm just gonna show you guys. So it's like a broom set. So I can turn into a broom and I can turn into a mop. Yes, the mop is dirty. I need to take that home. So over here we have the sink and just t touched it and it's wet <laughs> okay so we have the sink over here um comes with like a little like plunger thing to like empty out food i um, would lie i don't use that that often and then i just have my sunlight my gloves you know normal stuff hand soap this um rose gold rack is from mr price as well my cutlery is also from mr price 90% of the stuff is from Mr. Price. My hand towel with that little hook. That hook was there when I got here. Top here in this first cupboard, I have like my cutlery and glasses and stuff. Then in the bottom shelves under the sink, okay, yeah, I need to go fill up water. So that's why those two things are there. Usually one of them is in my fridge. So in the top here, it will usually just be like all this other kitchen equipment that's just for my milk frother then i usually keep the spare water bottle there and then when you come down i have all my pots my pots are from russell hobbs if you're wanting a similar set so it is rose gold and stuff so that is my stuff then we have like this little second section over here so I have this little plug which I keep my kettle and my toaster. My toaster is Bosch and my ke the kettle is from Clix. I am wanting to get this other set that's rose gold that will match this. So I am going to be selling this stuff soon. At the top here is where I keep most of my like ingredients and whatnot. So I have some um, rice, pasta, biltong in the back, some breadsticks some chocolates and over there is some rusks um cocoa powder popcorn this is empty and some flour and then olive oil and vinegar so that is the the top cupboard so i've organized all of that into console jars then over here is my little pantry it's a bit of a mess not gonna lie so i have some bread there and then i have like all my spices and stuff yeah, and then there's a few that I still need to buy some jars for and then yeah, all just groceries and stuff I'm not gonna go through all my groceries guys and then there's just spare stuff that I keep at the back and then just yeah then over here we have a extractor fan and it comes with like a light etc three different modes you can turn it on and off then at the top here I just store some spare stuff so I have like my recipe box so I'm like, um, coarse salt. There's just some random stuff at the back. I'm not sure what that is. Then there's just some extra, um, hot chocolate and coffee sachets and my shampoo. Then it comes with the stove. I'm sorry, my stove's a little bit dirty, but anyways. <laughs> so you have a four plate stove and it comes with a little mini oven. These oven mitts I got from Mr. Price. I'm actually not gonna open my oven, my oven's dirty. You also get this like little underneath this drawer <laughs> and I just keep like incense sticks, some sage, tin foil, my lighter, some candles in there. Then moving on to this side here, I have in this cupboard some tea, coffee, sugar and hot chocolate in these canisters. So that's that cupboard. Then over here, I have this little utensil holder. Um, the utensil holder and all of that is from Mr. Price. Um, 
these are all mismatched um, kitchen stuff. So yeah, I have this, it's like, it's an essential oil diffuser. So I have that over here. That's from at home. This spoon thing, spoon cooking. You can just put your spoon on here so that you don't dirty the counter. That is also from Mr. Price. Over here, I have all my cutlery and everything in here. It's a bit of a mess, I'm sorry. But yeah, that's all my cutlery. Over here, I literally just have pills and stuff in there. Little medical aid box that I DIY. My makeup all here. This is just some of the oils for my diffuser and my main pills that I take every day. So that's also a bit of a mess, I'm sorry. This is appalling, but anyway, this is just like all my Tupperware and glassware and stuff. And my lunch bag and my water bottle. That is the entire like kitchen. Um, as you can see, you could also put more stuff at the top there. I prefer leaving it completely clean at the top. I think that looks much better, but yeah. Moving on to this side. So this is the like study nook. So at the top there, I have all my like my hair dryer, straightener, etc. I have a little light box, some candles. That's my filing system at the back. A little planter thing that I got from at home. The baskets I got as a gift. So don't ask me where they're from. Um, I have this little drawing that Ali did in form four of my dog Sophie. Polaroid camera. I have this little fake plant as well from Mr. Price Home. I have some of my crystals and the jars that my crystals are in are also from Mr. Price. My little mirror is from At Home. There's a TV in the back here and you're probably thinking, like is she dumb? <laughs> no. Um, so the Mac is not mine. Just want to point that out there. The, the Mac is my university's like Mac. Um, this is the Mac that I work on. Because I'm a multi-student, we get assigned a specific Mac. So technically we own it for the year. In, in, I'm putting own it, I didn't buy it. We just put like, yeah, it's basically dedicated to us. So we were allowed to take them during um, online learning and because we're still doing online learning and everything, I still have mine. So I just keep it here on my desk, obviously, and it just comes with the keypad and the mouse, etc. Um, behind it, I have my Bose headphones. And then behind it over here, I just have three little like notebooks. I then have this um, pencil holder, sellotape holder and stapler from Typo. My mouse pad is a marble mouse pad that I got from Typo as well. And I just have my laptop, my iPad. Yeah, that's basically it. Oh, and these are just my glasses. Then down here, also a bit of a mess, I just have a basket for like cables and random shit. Then there's all these like plugs. You have like the Wi-Fi router and stuff there. I also have my fitness mat, the fitness mat I got from Sportsman's Warehouse. And what I like is that this place comes with like a really comfy chair. So I just put this throw on it, but this is what the chair looks like. So it's really comfy like to sit on for the whole day. I'm not even gonna lie to you. And it's got wheels. It's a little bit dirty because I also stand on it to reach the top of my cupboards. Yeah, and then over there I just keep my laptop bag. So moving on, here is my cupboards right next door to my desk area. I'm just gonna show you the cupboard space as well. So you have some space at the top. I just have some camera equipment at the top and some other random stuff. And I also keep spare linen. I have some of my clothes and baskets to organize my underwear. That's a mess as of my sweatpants and shoes, please. I'm so sorry. <laughs> and then I have my shoes at the bottom here. This is really bad. I'm not this person, I promise. I really am not. But, you know, just been in a rush these days. So, yeah. Now, this is probably my favorite part of my entire room. It is like the bedroom and like little sitting area.
my linen and everything is from at home so this like bedding this white bedding i've had it for ages though um this little like fluffy blankets from at home this is a teddy bear that ali gave me last year when i was sick he sent it down um then this like mink it's fake mink by the way blanket is from um mr price then I have this little knotted cushion that Cav got me as just like a little gift. So yeah, that's my bed. Uh, I also have an electric blanket. It doesn't fit the whole double bed because I was in Acre last year, Academia, and it was only a single bed. So I just have the single like electric blanket on the one side, which is fine. Then over here, I have like my rosary. I also have just this little lamp desk lamp although i've like tilted it upwards so it kind of shines quite nicely like up okay so that's what i do um then i have like my amethyst crystal i have my little uh, fairy light switch over there um there's the remote for the tv down there that's just where i keep my retainer and my pill and then this is some of my jewelry and some other stuff, my A my AirPods, etc. I have some books down there, and yeah, random, random, random shit. Okay. <laughs> and then in these like little compartments, I only I just have like another two jars of crystals in here, and then that one's just empty. I got my fairy lights, so they're copper wired fairy lights. I got them from Builders Warehouse. I then got these two cushions from Mr. Price. So it didn't come with actual cushions. I got the cushions separately and then I got covers for them. I also got these from Mr. Price. So these, all my cushions are actually from Mr. Price. This like little throw blanket thing I got from Volks. Then on the top here, I just have like this name thing. I don't know where that's from. I've had that for a long time if you see my room tour from like three years ago this was like plastered onto my door so i just brought those here i then have this painting that ali did for me as a christmas present for 2018 um it's a photo of us in kariba i then have this clock i also don't know where this is from i've had it for <clears throat> a really long time so i'm sorry i don't know where it's from <laughs> i have this candle it is the sugar bush candle from mr price and then you have the aircon remote like plastered on the wall and that is the aircon then i brought in my table um at home i brought it in because i just want extra shelving space so i just put it here so i have this plant from mr price as well i used to have my other little healing plant that ali got me for valentine's day but babe if you're watching it is at home because it needed some sun <laughs> so yeah and then i just have this incense stick holder which is the hamza hand which is also really nice i'm not sure where that's from i've had it for quite a while but i'm pretty sure you can find it easily i then have my himalayan salt lamp also, I got this in Zim, but someone ordered it for me. I'm not sure where they got them from, but I know if you go to um, oh, the Scratch Patch, I know that they will sell these. I then have another crystal here, and I then have my beat speaker on the bottom. And then, if you're wondering where my rug's from, big guess, Mr. Price Home. <laughs> okay, so it comes with this little shutter thing. Um, I don't really feel like going outside and <laughs> talking, <laughs> so I'm gonna just stay inside. But I, these are like the chairs and the table that comes with ink. So the cushions that I have on there are also from Mr. Price Home. So you just tie them onto the chair and then it's there. That is not my um, hub, that's Cav's hub. We just decided to leave it here because mine was like breaking and stuff. But mine seems to be working again. I don't know, it's weird. Then I have this like little candle holder which I put water and like little floating candle things inside there. And then it like makes it look all pretty. I then have a rose quartz crystal on the table as well. And then as you can see there, there's like a drainage Thing for like rain and stuff in there in the corner is my hub and it's carry bag and then there's like little box there and that's where I keep all my um, flavor and everything so as you can see it's a pretty big veranda area also when I have people over I usually just make them jump over this little ledge here and into the veranda and also sometimes they sit on the ledge so 
yeah so that is like my entire like apartment i have been at campus here and i've been at academia and this is more expensive <laughs> like a lot more but i find it really worth it like with the price and everything and i just i really love like the landlady here she's amazing honestly love it the building's small the people are nice i hope you guys enjoyed my little tour i love you all so so much and i'll see you in my next video bye guys